Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Esperanza. I am a full-time content creator with a background in interior design. So I am here today with Indio. You can't see him right now, but you probably will throughout this video. He's just hanging out with me here in the bedroom. And if you guys are regulars on my channel, you may notice that the background is a little bit different today in the bedroom. There's Indio now. Um, we had to, we basically moved everything in the bedroom around. I will be doing a bedroom tour very soon. We are just waiting for our new dresser to get here, which was supposed to arrive yesterday, but most likely it'll be here today. So I'll be sharing a bedroom tour with you guys very soon. So in today's video, I actually wanted to share a thrift haul with you guys of some really cute shoes and a few boho decor pieces that my parents bought for me over the past weekend. So last week I actually went to Salem, Oregon for my nephew Brio's baptism and my sister was able to make it and my parents also were there. So it was kind of like a little family get together and we were able to do some thrifting and my parents bought these for me, which was super nice of them. So some really nice shoes and some cute boho decor. So let's go ahead and get into the thrift haul. Okay, so I'll start off with the boho decor pieces. First up is this very cute little basket here. It's a teeny bit warped. It probably just got squished in like a big box or something, but I can easily shape this by putting a wine bottle inside. I'm pretty sure that this is what this basket is for. Basically just to like put your wine bottle in here and carry it around for like a picnic or maybe to give it to someone as a gift, something like that. But I thought this would be very, very cute. I actually do a lot of campaigns with like different wine companies and stuff like that. And I thought that this would be a very cute way of presenting a wine brand or something like that, or just taking it along on like a picnic or something. So I picked this up and this was $2.99. I also opened my boho decor shop, Urban Darling Shop, back up. It took me a while to do that after our move, but I'm finally getting back into that. And this is totally the kind of item that I would sell in my shop, although I'm going to be keeping this one for myself. So next up, my parents also got me this basket here. I saw this on the shelf in the basket section when I was browsing that section with my mom, and I picked it up immediately because I love this style. It's like very Southwestern, but also definitely has a Spanish feel to it. As you guys may know, or you might not know, I am actually half Colombian, so I'm always very drawn to things that have like a Spanish, you know, South American type feel to them. And I definitely gear towards these kind of decor pieces in my own interior design style. As you guys can see, that's actually a Colombian hanging right there that my mom gave me. So I definitely love picking up things like this. They always really go well with my aesthetic. So this basket was $4.99 and it does have like just a little bit of minor wear and tear on like the edges and stuff, but nothing super, super noticeable or super wrong with it. So definitely a very, very cool find. So next up we have this little purse. So this was the only like accessory that I picked up, but it's definitely in that boho style that I love. I love the bamboo handles, the gold hardware. I definitely lean towards gold over like silver or any of those other kind of metals. So this was super, super cute. And I actually saw this on the shelf right before we were checking out and my mom grabbed it for me, which was really sweet of her. So this is actually an authentic St. John's Bay purse. And I love that brand. I always definitely try to thrift St. John's Bay clothing and all that good stuff. So this was definitely a great find. And I don't see the label right now, but I think this purse was like $5.99 or $6.99, something like that. But I love the color of it. It's kind of like a top, topy mauve color, perfect for spring and summer. 
So next up I have three pairs of shoes. I actually spent a lot of time in the shoe section with my mom and dad trying to find some sandals that were good for summer but then I ended up finding like so many other cute shoe styles as well in like amazing brands. So my parents kindly bought me three pairs. So this pair of Born loafers. So I think these are super cute. They're in like this brown crocodile type style and then on the bottom it has like this really good sole that is like great for grip this like style of sole rubber sole whatever and they are super comfy i actually used to work at a shoe store when i used to work retail in college so i definitely know all of like the really good shoe brands so whenever i see those at the, at the thrift store i always try to pick up really good quality shoes especially because i do end up having like a lot of foot pain and stuff like that so a great pair of shoes makes a really big difference so i thought these were so cute they're perfect for pretty much all seasons maybe except for winter if there's like snow but they're great for fall especially i could totally see myself pairing this with like a great pair of levi jeans and a cute like turtleneck sweater but i'm also actually wearing it today with this dress Skylar and I are about to go out for the day, so I'm wearing this dress, um, kind of like a sweater dress, and these loafer style shoes. And these were $19.99, so their shoe section was a little bit spendy, but like I said, the all three of these shoes are from really good quality shoe brands. I also got this pair of Born clogs, like slip-on clogs. They're in this really pretty red color and they definitely look like they weren't worn a ton. So almost like practically brand new, which is awesome. These were, hmm, I don't see. Oh yeah, that's right. These did not have a label on them. So I think they sold them to us for maybe $5.99. I could be wrong. So definitely a steal for these and they are so, so comfy. They're in the size 738 which is perfect for me. I usually have problems because I'm more of like a seven and a half, but sometimes I have to get like a size eight because I have wider feet, but these fit me absolutely perfectly. So I'm thrilled about these. And these are another pair of shoes that you could totally wear spring, summer, fall. So very versatile. And I thought these were super, super cute. Great, comfortable shoe option. So these are from the brand Naturalizer. They are a size seven and they do fit me a little bit snug, but not too snug, basically like just right. So I was very glad that I was able to find a pair of sandals that worked for me because I do need some more sandals going into spring, summer. And I love that these are like a very neutral style and the crisscross details are really cute as well and they do have straps like adjustable straps and these are velcro so they are very easy to get on and off and just like a very great neutral sandal for spring summer and these were $14.99 so like I said a little like surprisingly I thought a little bit spendy for their shoe section but these are really good quality shoe brands. So thrifting is definitely something that we always end up doing whenever we are able to get together as a family and I'm very thankful that my parents so generously bought me these items and I cannot wait to wear these shoes. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and if you guys are not subscribed yet, please be sure to subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Also, don't forget to check me out on all my socials at The Urban Darling and my blog, TheUrbanDarling.com for more lifestyle content. And definitely check back for my upcoming videos. I'm going to be sharing a bedroom tour very soon. And Skylar and I are actually filming a couples Q&A video later today. Not sure what order these are going to be going up in, but those are some of my upcoming videos. So please make sure that you're subscribed and that you have your bell notifications turned on. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next videos. Bye!